right, I think we need to do a roadster race. Roadster race only. So I think we're gonna do, I've got all the roadsters here. So we're gonna do blue car. It's the uh, roadster bite. We'll throw him in lane five. Let's see what else. We got a bunch of those roadster bites. All right, this guy is the glory chaser glory chaser we'll put glory chaser in lane two interesting name for sure uh, look at that roadster bite again uh oh the viper is a roadster as well do the viper we'll put viper in lane one maybe it fits a little better there okay and then the what was it the black car what is that car? Oh yeah, it's a Corvette Grand Sport. Where is that guy? There he is. Corvette Grand Sport. Um, lane six, sure, why not? All right, let's see who's gonna win this one. I'm gonna say either the Roadster Bite or the Viper maybe. I have no idea about this. This one, I have not raced it yet. So here we go. Any mark, get set. Go. Oh man, that one's fast. Wow. All right, this is our new Roadster winner right here. This, what was it called again? I already forgot. Glory Chaser. How could I forget? How could I forget? Glory Chaser's your winner out of all of our Roadsters. All right, keep an eye out for that one then. All right, this is bugging me, so. I think we need to race this one again, get another, give this one another shot, but I'm not going to put it in lane two because I feel like this track has a tendency to lean towards lane two winning. So let's try lane five with the glory chaser <laughs> and this brick of delivery, these Lego ones, some of these are crazy fast lately. So I'm going to put him in lane one. This... Camaro seems to be consistently pretty darn quick. So we're going to throw that one into lane, I don't know, lane two, I guess. And then I want to do this Roadster Bite. This is the secret one that seems to be faster than the others. So I'm going to run this one in lane six. I'm convinced it's the fastest car we have, but we're going to see now if it's... If I'm just wrong or what. All right. So in theory, this one might win. This one usually wins. These two are good close seconds. So we'll see how this turns out. All right, I'm right. Get set. Go. Oh, it was the Camaro. Lane two. Camaro. Again, lane two. What is the deal with lane two? What is going on with lane two? Because when I raced this one in lane two... It just took off from everybody. So, something strange seems to be going on. Let's switch it up again. Let's try, <clears throat> swap him around. Let's try Camaro lane one. Let's try Roadster, or rather Glory Chaser in lane two. This one back in lane six. Let me flip this one around. Let's try this out. Make sure everybody's nice and straight. Okay, let's give this one a go. Mark, get set, go. Lane six. Lane six. Lane six. Okay, so again, this one is pretty darn fast overall. Um, this one did not land in lane two this time. So, I don't know, maybe I'm just crazy, but it seems like Lane two, oftentimes, like if you put like your fastest car, like let's, all right, let's go this way. If you put your fastest car in lane two, it seems like that's a guaranteed win almost. So I don't know. Let's see. Mark, it's a go. Winner, I guess I'm wrong. Five. Lane five. It's this one. All right, let's switch these up now. Let's put Glory Chaser in lane five. And 
Roadster Bite in lane two. So in theory, Roadster Bite should win. Mark, gets it, go! Yep, Roadster Bite, lane two. So if you have a guaranteed fast car, lane two seems like a good bet oftentimes. I don't know what it is about lane two. I mean, I can't tell. There's some reason lane two would win more often, but that seems to be the case. I don't know. You guys tell me. What do you think?